Hi everyone, so you want to start this design out by painting all of your nails with one coat of white. And as you can see, it's not done perfectly. That's not what you're trying to achieve here. You just want that little bit of white background for the next step of our design. Next, I'm going to use all of these nail polish colors, and of course you can use your favorite colors. So I've decided to go ahead and just draw vertical lines down my nails. I figured it would be easier, and you can fit more colors that way. So I'm going to go ahead and do that to all my nails, and come back and show you the next step. I went ahead and done all of my nails, and next what you want to do is tape your fingers just like you would when you're doing your water marble design. I've got my tape here. I'm just going to show you guys how to do it real quick. Apply the tape on one side and scoop the tape under the nail around and then cover right above the cuticle part. Make sure the tape is fastened down. I'm going to go ahead and do that to all the fingers on this hand and I'll come back. I've gone ahead and taped my fingers and I've got my little container here with some room temperature water and I'm going to grab two of my favorite colors which is a blue like a deep sky blue and a hot pink sort of fuchsia color. Here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna create your bullseye first and then you're gonna use your hand sanitizer spray bottle and in this bottle I just have hand sanitizer mixed with rubbing alcohol just to dilute it a little bit and make the um, spray come out a little bit more evenly into like a mist and it's going to create that uh, water spotted look that you want. I went ahead and removed the tape, cleaned up around my cuticles and this is what it turned out like. So I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial. Don't forget to follow me on Google+, Twitter and Facebook. Give this design a try guys using your favorite colors and see how the water spotted funky manicure will work for you. Thanks so much for watching, subscribing and commenting. I will see you all in my next tutorial. Bye for now.